Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I have done some damage. As you can see behind me, I have it Fendi unbagging. I actually took it out of the box and I did take a little peek because I just couldn't wait. I got it yesterday and I have some Estee Lauder to share with you. If you wanna see what's in that Fendi bag, stick around. Don't go any further. This is my bag of the week, my medium Chanel Coco handle with the exotic lizard handle. Oh, yes, I love it. I'm having a love affair with this bag. It makes my heart go pitter patter. <laughs> I definitely would love to add a black one to my collection or a beige one or maybe a green one. I don't know. I just, I love it so much. And you guys with all the insane price increases, Louis Vuitton just had another one. I mean, come on, come on. It's crazy. And I think next week Chanel is having yet another one. So really with all these insane price increases, it really does pay to find some really good resellers and be a member of the Facebook groups, the Ritzy, Chanel, and Louis Vuitton Facebook group. Um, because there's some fabulous sellers on there, trusted sellers, and you can get good deals. I felt like I got a really good deal with this one. I got it from my friend, Dr. Fatina. I'm loving this bag. And I, I, I just love it. It's, oh, it's just gorgeous. Okay, so I wanted to share with you guys, you know I have turned into a luxury lippy lover. So I'm wearing Tom Ford. I like it because it's just, it's, like it's not in your face, but it's a nice, pretty kind of a neutral color and I love neutrals for every day. So, Tom Ford. I ordered an eyeshadow palette. I tore into it so I didn't show it to you guys, but I will at some point. So I'm also, oh, I'm also wearing the eyeshadow. So, it goes on really pretty. But I would say Tom Ford eyeshadow is equivalent to Estee Lauder. And for the price difference, I'm digging the Estee Lauder. But I really am digging this lipstick, and it's a little tiny one. And I definitely, um, when I get close to using this one up, will order another one. And again, the name is Casablanca. So I ordered this, um, this kit. Now, you guys know I'm always talking about skincare, and most of what I use, I do get from uh, my spa um, and I use Revision, I use Skin Medica and they're very pricey. So I don't use them twice a day like they say to. So I like to buy products like this to use in between. So I actually have not used Estee Lauder in a really long time. So I saw this kit and it's the Radiant Skin Repair and Renew Kit and you get the advanced night repair. You get a large one and a smaller one. You get the eye cream and you get a revitalizing supreme moisture. So I thought, I'll pick up this kit. Well, really, I was looking for something like this because I've been wanting to try this again. It's been a really long time since I've, I've had any and I thought I would put the small one in my travel kit. So that was, I think this was like $110 for all of this and I love the eye cream. So with any purchase of 75 or more, you could get this kit for 60 bucks. So I thought, wow, look at all that. So I'm gonna tell you guys, I don't buy a lot of makeup. And I, last year, cleaned out three huge drawers full of eyeshadow palettes. You would not believe how much stuff that I got rid of. All really good stuff, but it's just me using it. And so it was gonna sit in there for the next five years. There was no way I could use all that stuff. And I don't like that. Like, I don't like it to just sit there. So I gave some to my mom, I gave some to my daughter, but I don't really buy a lot. Like right now I have two eyeshadow palettes before I got all this. And that's all I had and a couple little extra um, colors that I have in individuals. But I don't know, I just, I, I thought, wow, this is so fun. This looks like a great deal. Okay. So it was $75 with, okay, I told you wrong. <laughs> okay, so this was $75 with any $45 Estee Lauder purchase 
and this is supposed to be a $400, $455 value. So I could have swore I paid $60 for this, but anyway, whatever. I know I paid $110 for this. So I got this and I got this. And I'm really excited because I do love Estee Lauder. It's the nicest little velvety kit. And I haven't really, I, I opened it up and took a little peek, but I haven't really went through it. Okay, look at that. I love it. What a cute little makeup kit. It's red velvet and it looks expensive. Oh, that could be a handbag. <laughs> it looks expensive and it feels expensive actually. So I think that these kits, are, well, I have to have scissors. I think these kits are actually still available uh, online. So it comes with this card, little Christmas card. Look at that kit. I love it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So it does have some of the uh, night repair serum that I was, that I purchased there. It also has the eye cream that I absolutely love. It has more of the same. So all of this, all of this is in here. And it also has the eye makeup remover. It has three lippies, three lippies, two lip glosses, a mascara, which I've never, I've never tried um, Estee Lauder mascara. I love this little velvety case because it would be a great little travel, you know, to put your makeup in when you travel or anything. You could use it for just about anything because it's flat and you could just sit it down in your suitcase like that. So I have to admit, one of the reasons I wanted this kit so bad was because it's got three eyeshadow kits, palettes. Okay, so this one is called Pure Color Envy Eyeshadow Palette, and this is the nudes. And on the back side, it tells um, the different colors. So these are the nudes. These colors are beautiful, and they have a, some of them have a little bit of a shimmer. Okay, because like I said, I don't buy much makeup. I cut up my Ulta card, you guys. That thing was dangerous. Okay, so this is the Glam Palette. <gasps> Ooh, look at that. That's the Glam Palette. Look at that. Oh my gosh, I love the blues. This is the Glow Palette. Oh, so this is blush and highlighter and a bronzer. Beautiful, I love that pink. I have one drawer of makeup, that's it. And that's all I need. Well, I got this for fun and I'm super excited. Oh, look at that. That is bam. That is gorgeous. Okay. And the next color, I would guess it's probably a nude, I'm not sure. Knockout Nude. Bam. Look at that. Wow. That is so pretty. I love nudes. Okay. Glosses. Skincare I told you about, and also a mascara. And like I said, I've never tried Estee Lauder. <laughs> That's not coming out. Yeah. Okay, so Sumptuous Extreme Multi Multiplying Volume Mascara. Oh yeah, baby. So I don't know. I will have to try this and let you guys know because I have used L'Oreal for as long as I can remember and that's my jam. I love L'Oreal. My daughter said she's tried every kind of mascara there is and there's nothing better than L'Oreal. So we'll see. But you know what? I already like the way this looks. See, I like a wand that is straight like that. It already looks to be pretty thick. Oh wow. So I'm excited about this. So maybe I'll do, do you guys want to see like a makeup look? I could do a glam look for you. <laughs> so I got all those things. So here it is. So see, would that not be great for traveling? Super exciting. <sighs> Bam. <laughs> okay, you guys. Now, I really didn't mean to start the year out like this, 
but sometimes things happen. You know what I mean? It's my first Farfetch purchase. I honestly think it came within three days. And it looks like it was shipped from New York. So it's in this bag. It's not a handbag. I'm so excited. Okay, here it comes, here it comes. Okay, here it comes, if I can get a hold of it. It's a shawl, a shawl, a wool shawl. It is so soft. Oh my gosh, I did get it out and take a peek. Fendi, tag. I did get it out and take a peek. Now you guys, I'm not much of a scarf wearer, although I did see a Fendi scarf that I liked, but I do love a nice shawl and I've always wanted one and I had always thought I wanted a Louis Vuitton and then I had thought about this and then I saw Marie, she had one. I mean, I copied her, but well, who wouldn't want to copy her, right? Okay. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, wow. It's so soft. So when I first got it, and I asked Muddy, I said, is it soft? And she said, very soft. $1,285.20. I mean, it's expensive, but it's less expensive than a Neverfull. And don't get me started. Don't get me started on Louis Vuitton. I actually, okay, don't get me started. <laughs> I'm just gonna walk around the house all day like this. Yeah, I love it. All right, so um, that's all I have today. Just a little Fendi unboxing. I'm in love with this. I'm back. All right, so this is the second item that I was talking about. Keith just came home from work and gave it to me. So this is a true unboxing. You know how I am about true unboxing. The ones that I've done, a lot of them have not went well. Ooh, I like that box. Okay, so here it is. I went Fendi crazy lately. And it comes in this dust bag. And <laughs> I got Fendi socks. These are so cute, and I'm gonna wear them with loafers. I saw them on Instagram. Someone had them on with some clunky loafers and a cute little skirt, and I thought it was really cute. And I like to wear slides. Actually, I don't have any that would go with this, but I'll wear them with like, I will wear these with uh, ankle boots with a little bit of the Fendi part, you know, sticking out like that. Isn't that cute? So, it's my very first pair of Fendi socks. All right, so that's all I have for you guys today, and I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.